Okay. Some weird capsule completely submerged underwater. That's never a good sign. Now look at it. So welcome to Collision Course. I've wanted to play this since forever. And today is that day when we take a look at it. I really don't know too much about what goes on in this. But I'll tell you guys what I know. Apparently there's a comet that's coming to cause complete destruction on this world. And we've got to sneak, scavenge and survive our way through it. Now there's prehistoric creatures, there's droids, there's humans. I don't know if they're like survivors or anything like that. I guess we'll find out. But I thought it was interesting. And I thought it was worth a look. So here we go. Right, primary mission. So you're about to free roam, explore points of interest. Okay, so still being worked on. We got ourselves a pistol. This guy's wearing some cool gear. Let's have a look if we got... Okay, so we have an inventory system. Items, gear, survival tip. It can take time for illness to cure. So you can get ill in this as well. Illnesses. Listeria, dysentery, and sepsis. <laughs> There's a lot to it then. Okay. Objectives, map. Oh, look at that wreck. So is that what we came down with then? And that acted as like an evac pod or something? And we survived. And unfortunately, I don't think they did. All right, let's pick this up then. Some glasses. My suit's power. Oh, bio scanners. Okay, so. Oh! Can you guys see that? That's something that we haven't seen. Wait, are those? Oh, I thought those were Therizinos. It's actually. Is it a, a Bronto or a Brachy or something? Oh, we have to go and take a look at that. That's such a cool noise as well. It made my ears vibrate. Like, what did it say? It said we could do something with them. Bioscanner. Scans the biological signatures within a 75 meter range. Drain survival suit. So our suit has power then. I don't see... Oh, in the bottom left corner there, I think it's that blue. Oh, it's the green bar. So we can actually see what these are. So how do we scan them though, does it say? Some kind of trilobite creature or something? I'm going to keep moving. I'm just trying to take it all in. <laughs> I keep hearing them making noises and I just want to see them again. There is a case down here. It's got something in it that I can open. All right, what we got? A to take. Some pills. Some kind of mineral or something. It's like a CPU or a chip. Let's take a look at what we got then. Motion sensor. Proximity sensor from the ship. Antibiotics. A solar cell. Collects power from solar energy and a circuit board. Oh, there we go. Yo, this place is enormous. Look at that. It just goes on forever. I'm guessing this is what we've got to take a look at. There's some hills, mountains off in the distance. There's another little island there. I wonder if there's some stuff over that side too. It's like a carnivore skull. What was big enough to take that thing down? You know, that was the first thing that went through my mind. It wasn't go over and have a look at the cool skull. It was what was big enough to take it down. What was big enough to kill it. <laughs> These are the things you got to think about. Anything in the area? Is that a little stick or something? Okay, you can just you can just randomly throw stuff. That's really cool though. Definitely heard stomping. I know this is kind of stupid. Why would you walk towards the gigantic footsteps? But I just want to know. Oh! Is that a Spinosaurus? Looks like some prisoners organized a camp. Maybe they'd be interested. added prisoner camp. Oh, no, 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 no. Get out of the line of sight. Nope. Is that thing? Oh, yeah, it's coming this way. Okay, we're hiding this big thing. POI added prisoner camp. Okay, so where do we see that, though? A stronghold formed by a group of prisoners. They may be willing to make some trades. Oh, okay, so they, they may be friendly then. Well, I, I don't know if they know they've got a Spinosaurus literally outside of the door. <laughs> Should probably warn them. Got water down there. I'm not really seeing anything that we have to... I mean, I'm not noticing these things going down. I'm just constantly keeping an eye out for things like that, like water and stuff, to see if we can collect it. 
Whoa. Something just whispered me then. Did you guys catch that? It just went... Some freaky shit. Oh! Oh, that's so sick! You guys know how much I love dinosaurs. If you don't, if you're new to the channel, I grew up absolutely obsessed with dinosaurs. So seeing stuff like this in a game, it just puts a big smile on my face. It's really cool. I wanted to get a little bit closer to them to see if they acted up or if they warned me off or something with like a tail swipe or a stomp or something and they're not doing anything. They're not phased. I mean, why should they be? Oh! <laughs> oh my! Okay, you just came out of nowhere. That's a T-Rex. Oh, no. don't you do it, T-Rex, please. Oh! Oh, wait, was that... Oh, no, was that us? Oh, no, 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 no. That's so, that's so unfair. You have massive, massive dinosaurs there to feast on. And you're coming after me. Has it done a U-turn? I think it has. Wait, it's still charging towards us. No, okay, we're bolting. I'm just going to keep going in this direction. Oh, yeah, those things are raptors. Look at them. They're eyeballing me as well. They don't know what I am. They're working me out. Where did that Rex go, though? Okay, I don't know if you guys just caught that then. But it looked like the Rex just growled at the Raptor and it went charging towards it. The Raptor just bolted. Which, I mean, you would do. <laughs> but how cool is that? There's interaction between the dinosaurs. Or at least it appears that way. I don't know. Maybe I just caught it at the perfect time. Oh, yeah. It's really coming this way. When you hear those stumps like that, <laughs> it's just terrifying. Come on. Go down, Rex. Go down, Rex. Oh, no. Oh, Raptor, no. <laughs> I don't need you right now. You guys just see that? There's just a Raptor just stood there with his head tilted. This is so freaky. Oh, wait, he did. It went for the Raptor, so it does do that. I mean, I've nailed it with a couple of shots. Oh. We've just destroyed the T-Rex. Don't you even think about it. If that raptor goes towards that thinking he's got a free meal, he's got another thing coming. I had no idea this pistol was that good. <laughs> oh, that's another one. What is that? That's like an acro or something. Or an aloe? Oh, that's an allosaurus. I see the crest on the top of its nose. <laughs> oh my god. Was that thing just waiting in the trees the whole entire time? There it is. There's the proof. We took down the Rex. That pistol was so powerful. I mean, it's a shame that I've wasted every single round. <laughs> Unless it was like explosive ammo or something. Such a cool model as well. It really does remind me of the one from Jurassic Park. Just scaled down a little bit. Where's that Allosaurus gone? Or whatever the hell it was. At least I thought it looked like that. Wait, what's that over there? I thought that these dust things meant that something was walking around. Whatever it was, it... I think that's the the big guys. Whatever it was, it just came charging out of those trees. I didn't see it till the very last second. And it is absolutely becoming nighttime now. I've got to say as well, it runs way better than I thought it would. There is a weird, like, stuttering that happens every now and again, but it's something that you kind of expect when you play early access games. I mean, from what we've seen so far with, <laughs> with the dinosaurs and, and how big this place looks... Oh. All right, I'm just going to keep going. I'm going to hear so many grunts. Oh my god, that's absolutely terrifying. I was moving and it sounded like something was literally on my six. 
oh, I don't want to keep my light on because it makes me think that they're seeing my light. <laughs> That's what's triggering the sounds. But if I don't turn it on, I mean, this is what I'm seeing, guys. Like, this it's just pitch black and you get the silhouettes of the trees. And every now and again, you'll hear, like, movement of something walking around. If it wasn't scary before, <laughs> everything is terrifying now. I really wish I would have kept some rounds for that pistol. I mean, it's cool that we took down the Rex, but... I really want something to defend myself with. I can't. I mean, I'm carrying this stick like it's going to do anything. Let's just throw it. Look. You saw that? That grass was moving. It's like when every time you turn around, there's, there's like movement behind you as if something's just been there. I can hear that. What was that? Who are you? Okay, nice. Well, we've got a steel bar from him. What are you doing just hanging out in the swamps? Okay, what did we pick up there? What's this? A breathing mask allows for faster stamina regeneration. Can we apply that to our character? I think it already is. A rock. Quite heavy for its size. <laughs> okay, I don't think we need that. Med pack? I mean, let's just use that top off a little bit. At least we've got like a... Oh, wait. I think we just replenished our ammunition. And we have the steel bar as well. How do I switch to that in case I need it? Okay, it's just on the scroll wheel. I was just walking in and somebody just said, don't come any closer. What, what's he doing? Just... Oh. Can we pick you guys up? Little toad. Oh, we can pick him up. Look, I don't know if you guys can see that. I can just see his arm. Right, let's grab him. Wait. Oh, no, I threw you back down on the floor. Wait, no, 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 no. Okay, we press F. There we go. Raw meat has been added. We've got some toad meat. Nourishes 75% of hunger, but could also cause listeria. Used with caution. Right, so let's go to illnesses. Caused by consuming raw meat. Symptoms may include vision problems and decreased stamina. I'm willing to ri risk it, but not quite yet. We're okay. I, I do need water, though. What the hell was that? What is that noise? I saw that. I caught that. You guys see that? The grass moved. Yep. No, I'm not hanging around. Oh my god, this game. Okay, yeah, no. I'm just going to get to a high ground. And I'm just going to take a minute. I'm actually frozen in fear. I did not just stumble across a raptor's nest. There's no way my luck is that bad. I mean, that could be what I've been hearing. They're small enough to be stayed concealed in within the swamp, but can I pick them up? Oh my god, I actually can. What is it? It's a Utah raptor egg. It's <laughs> I've literally just stumbled in to a raptor's nest. Flower Swamp Violet has medicinal uses and contains a small amount of water and food. Okay, let's... Oh, yeah, it does. Okay, so it gives us a little bit of that. I don't actually see, or I didn't see, what how much food it gave us. So you can pick things from the wild as well to be able to survive. Can we eat one of these? 50% of hunger. I can't believe I've just eaten a raptor egg. I'm such a badass. Until the pack catches up to me and then I'm going to be screaming. I just want to find, like, a building or something or... Something that we can just hold out in, you know? We've got a little bit of food now. I need to find some water, though, because... What is that? Oh, my God. That's a compy, isn't it? Where did it go? There's compies in this as well. They're not bad when they're on their own like that. It's when they're in big groups. It's 
the spino. We gotta go. We gotta go. Oh, no, no. I'm not looking back. What about this stuff? Is it going to get tangled in this stuff? Oh my god, I'm underwater now! Oh! Wait, what's that? Like an electric eel or something? Oh my god, everything is out to kill me in this. I thought Primal was bad. This is ten times worse than that. I've just stumbled across this. I think that was a herbivore. Whatever was big enough to take that down. I did not want to run into at night time. Oh yeah, no, there's definitely fire coming from over there. Right, let's try and get across this. It's a shallow... What was that? Oh my god. I, I've got to say as well, they've done an amazing job. It's getting too hot. Oh wait, there's a vault. This is volcanic, isn't it? They've done such an amazing job with the vocalizations. Because you hardly hear something that sounds the same over and over again. Oh, look at that. There's a heat haze that's just appeared. Okay, we don't want to be getting too close to that. <laughs> Dinosaurs don't finish us off. The lava will. So I've just found this. Somebody's in those bushes over there with a torch. Are they going to be friendly or are there some compies around too? You don't look friendly to me. Can I speak to you or are you going to lose your damn mind? Yeah, you don't look friendly at all. No! <laughs> That's not how we go out. Spino. Oh, wait. No, we're not dead. Wait, did it just pick us up and throw us into the water like that? Oh my god, did we just escape? Come on, get up. Oh, we're bleeding. No, no, no. Oh my... Spino down. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, you look amazing too. All right, what can I do with you guys? Can I can I harvest you for anything? Don't think I have anything that I can break you up with. No, no. Stim pack. Let's just use that. Eat one of those. Can I not drink like from this or something? Oh, there we go. We're we gonna get really sick from that though. Oh my! You guys just catch that? The side of the mountain just fell to pieces. Oh. That was probably why the volcanoes just erupted. Alright, this one's for Muldoon. Wait till it gets a little bit closer and... There we go. Probably just wasted all of my ammunition, but... Absolutely worth it. Nice. My thoughts exactly. Just found some random ammunition in the forest. Okay, so I guess with that, guys, I think this is where we're going to leave it. But I'm actually really surprised by Collision Course. I didn't think any of the stuff that we've come across in today's episode would actually be in the game. I thought that was all stuff planned for the future. There's a vibe that this game gives off as well. Like, you just... I didn't even see this thing, and it was right in front of us, just as I was talking to you guys. I think that's a Diabloceratops. You get a sense of how heavy they are as well. Listen to that. It's actually so cool, this game. It really is. But guys, I think with that being said, let me know if you guys want to see more. I don't know if these guys are going to be aggressive. So, oh, oh, no. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to upset you. Just keep going. 
I'm going to probably push them into a carnivore now. You're going to see just a massive T-Rex appear. But you guys know what to do. If you want to see more of this, drop a like below. And we'll get into some crazy adventures in this prehistoric world. <laughs> I'm kind of tempted to at least do a little bit more digging and just see what else it has to offer. Because obviously, with it being in early access, it's probably got limited content. But, I mean, there's no harm in looking. So if you guys do want to see more, drop a like below. Subscribe if you are new to the channel to keep up to date with everything. And I'll see you all in the next one.